Hello. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, now it should work. Hello, my little witchlings. Welcome. It's a new week. Um. Yeah, I had a pretty uneventful, well, not completely uneventful uh, weekend. That's not true. Uh, my boyfriend had his birthday, so we went out for drinks, and that was really nice. That was really, really nice. Uh, it's been a while since we've been out for drinks. And the cocktails are just so good. They're like potions. They're magic. True magic. Like, they make you feel different. Truly magic. Certainly. Um, yeah, so... Today it's Monday, so we are gonna farm some local specialties later on. We are uh, gonna do our dailies grind. So our uh, four daily quests, use resin. Like I said, we're gonna do um, the local specialties farming. And we are probably gonna farm some enemies. And maybe do some lilans as well. And some uh, mine some ores. We're gonna see how much we want to do today. Uh, I think I have to turn up the. There. Okay. Now I think we have enough volume for this. Okay. Very well. So, um, I'm in a game already. Let me just switch. Oh, there we quick. There we go. One game to go. So I'm gonna immediately hop into my voice chat and see if there's anyone who wants to join us. Let's see, we get a login bonus. Oh, I also did the minigame event on a weekend with uh, friends, uh, including one friend who doesn't like streaming so much. So I finished this one up nicely. And uh, yeah, it wasn't too great, so not much lost. Uh, let's see. Divina Volpes. Oh, is that the... As is this one. But I have to do like the two Raidens first. Okay. Yeah, we also still have to do all of these. I have a bit stuff. And I only have these, these finished here. And this one half. And I still have to do the others. So yeah, uh, we're probably just gonna skip over the event once we do this. And for now, I'm gonna do my dailies real quick. I'm gonna start here. Come on, load faster, dear game. I'm sure you can do it. Let's see, move this around. Move this here. Perfect. Okay, we wanna go this way. And we're gonna heal up. I'm so looking forward to when I have more like dendro characters built and dendro stuff farmed that's gonna be so much fun because like all dendro teams i've tried so far have been so fun okay we want to do so we want to kill him first and 
And then we alt. I'm gonna use up this one. And go do this. Okay. Easy peasy. Then I'm gonna win the, the, the I can't speak. Uh I'm gonna do the one in the city last. Oh there's one right here. Then let's move over there. Can't lead to light chase. Okay. You want to catch up to the Chloe thing. Let's go here. Follow the wind. And that's enough. And then there should be one more up here. There is one here. And we have to go up this direction. Probably gonna be murder some enemies. At least I think so. Is it these mushrooms? No, not mushrooms, slimes. Australia Church Hall. Um, I see them. Okay, they're spawning really light. drops here just gonna take these then we're gonna go to the city and I think I took the wrong wrong teleporter here yep I wanted to take this one no this one thank you game Okay, uh, hi Gulshan. Uh, no, not you. I want to talk to the doctor here. So, how will we find anyone who will help at this hour? Well, what's wrong? Oh, hello there, traveler. Are you here for treatment? I'm just passing through. <laughs> Was it obvious? You're alright. I'm worried about something. Uh, I don't know why, but there's been an increasing number of people seeking treatment here. It's also lurking for sewing area clean. You want me to clean up? I have to enter and keep people safe. Okay. No, my sword. Okay. And this and wonderful. Uh, I finished. Have you cleaned up? Yes. Well, I thank you, dear doctor. And that's our dailies done. Wonderful. So let's get to dear Catherine. Add let's do... Let's set cookie out. Let's set sign out. 
Jung Yoon, Fischl, and Benny. And. Thank you for some. Daily commissions. Wonderful. That's two goals done. Ah, that's just a Benny one. Okay, uh, let me see. If I can get my friend to join me. Okay, um, today we want to go, like I said, with local specialties. So I'm going to go to my browser real quick. And oh, let's see. Um. Hello there, dear friend. How are you doing? I'm alright. Except for the fact that if I actually intend to pull for a child, that I might need to do more once I turn the main, and that's just painful. Oh yeah. Um, I can understand that sentiment. Ayato is thankfully only the Inazuma one. Uh, let me see. So I want to keep it for 666 for now. Like that. Okay. So, um, I finished up my dailies. I need to use up my resin, which would be for. I'm gonna put you in pause for now. Which I can use for Ningguang. So I'm gonna go into the, um, hmm, yeah, I think I'm gonna go into the Inazuma domain. So I'm gonna load up on condensed resin. And after that, it's local specialty time. I need stuff for Nahida, I need stuff for Kalei. And... Tinari and maybe Elan. Uh, let's see. So you're going for a lot of plants and maybe some shells. Exactly. Still has new stuff. Um, and I think I'm gonna like um, I already have my Nahida at 666 farmed, so I think I'm gonna keep her at that. And for now, only. Raise her level a bit more, uh, level up the other ones, and then go for artifacts. Because I think I can do much more damage with her if she has actually proper elemental mastery artifacts. Compared to just um, pushing uh, talent levels onto her for now. And then I'm gonna finish up Nahida uh, later when I'm done with like a bit more artifact farming. Check. <laughs> There is a fair jump of damage in her skill for siege level, so it's not terrible to level. Yeah, but like if you want the most out of the elemental mastery bonus she gives like every teammate, then you need like 900 to 1000 elemental mastery on her. Yeah, that fact exists. And right now, so I gave her for now sacrificial fragments on 8080. Um. Because I think it has a bit more elemental mastery than the other one. And with like really bad artifacts that are j just for the sake of um, having deep wood memory on her. She only has like 463. So I could raise that by a lot. Um, because like I said, I think she needs 900 to 1000 to give her full bonus. Yeah, so uh, it's like the max that she can show. Yeah, also her... Um, Trichama purification damage. Uh, yes, it does have a good skill ceiling, but also it already has a good elemental mastery um, yeah. ceiling with already 258, and that's only four uh, because I still need to raise her to um, like uh, two ascensions more up. So, yeah. Um, Listen, I'm not going to tell you how to raise your kids. <laughs> Oh, and I got an acquaint fade, so I can do one normal pull. Let me see if there's anything good for us. Is that the long way to dream? It's not. 
Uh, it's a raven bow. Close. Basically the same. Basically, yeah. Probably don't need either of them at the moment. That would be 300. Okay. Um, so yeah, I don't know if we can get 50 of the cow palata lotus today. Let's see. Um, because with that I could raise Nahida, like, by a lot. Oh, I, I mean, you can technically get those in my world because I don't need them anymore. I might jump over there if it's, like, only, like, a few left. Where is she? She is at. Sub my current. Because uh, current smell characters are always set. Next to me. No, let me I just. I'm not quite sure if I'm actually prepared to get Layla. Probably not, but that would be just a shift focus. Okay, I'm gonna jump to the talent domain and then you can come over if you want to. Do you have like a uh, Kalea the Traveler raised? Uh, I got some leveled, yeah. Um, because if you want to, we could go in with like. Let's see, where's she? Uh, like she... Bloom with Nilu if you want to. Uh, I think the Traveler would be the better one, though. I don't think I have. What artifacts do you have on them? Nothing too bad. Uh, which artifacts set do you have on your Nahido? Uh, deep wood. And I'll just sell some. Uh, good dreams on my traveler. Like oh. I know you can you can push her damage more with other uh, artifacts, but I just think like if I have, if I have her sometimes in an uh as a supporter off field, sometimes on field, sometimes quick swap. And sometimes she's just the only dendro character and other characters have just more useful artifacts on them. I think it's just easiest to have deep wood on her and be done with it. That should be decent enough, and maybe I got some Dendro Goblet lying around. Uh, oh, that's Mastery and Crit Damage, or oh, heck that one. And he is allowed to. Well, he still got his. Didn't I put the Ferrone Sword on? Oh, he still got his level sword. That's good. Yay, Pavonius. So he isn't entirely useless. So one traveler, so we have Melkind, and one blue. Uh, and we need to go like all the way to the back again so I can uh, position my jelly properly. Run! Run, little Kuzanali, run! Ah, uh, excuse me, game.
Holy! What was that damage? Oh yeah. I got a gold um. one. I would still wish for her to have like a shorter cooldown on her skill. Uh, what slot do you have on her? Her signature, right? Yep. Okay. Like, if I didn't have a signature weapon, then she would have a sacrificial. Yeah. I got lucky, so yeah, no. Nilu? Yep. Yeah, I can imagine. Like your quick dance moves. And that's actually, another gold. Nice. Like, sh she's actually thicker than my Johnny. <laughs> How much HP does she have? 55k. 55! Holy shit! That's a lot! That's a lot of that's a lot of HP. Yep. You don't look the part, Nilu. Where are you hiding those thick fives? You know, the right costume probably works. Let's see how much we get now. Holy shit, it really wants to please Ningguang. I got two gold. Yeah. But these drops are so good. These drops are so good, and so the rain is so pleasant. Maybe some other mans can just take a look and take notes. I'm sure you don't mean anything specific like the monster domain or anything. Should be the last one. Yep. Let's see if the last one's also lucky. And we get ah okay normal drop, but that was a really good run. It was basically a gold in every one. That was really good. Holy shit. Oh, Layla is now officially available in the optimizer. Bad one. Bad one. What would I need if I activated her? I would need more weekly boss drops and I would need a lot of her boss drops. And of course, more gemstones. Um, how do you want to use up your resin? Uh, well, I got like 
one character that I'm currently ex half expecting to get, so I would actually suffer through everybody's favorite domain. Mon's dead? Mm -hmm. Okay, shall we switch over to your world? So, I would do a three pack. I did some early. Okay, I did some earlier to get the resin flowing. And I'm actually considering whether I want to maybe get some careful when you spawn in. How dangerous could it be? Ah, yes, a branch. And I think I'm gonna close up some tabs real quick because my PC is starting to lag. After the lag 1000th tab. Yeah, I don't know. Sounds like a reasonable amount. And I think that I would need a lot of experience if I actually want to level up like two characters. I would I own <laughs> Okay, I don't need you. That would actually be kind of a problem. Can close you, I can close up all of you since the new TFT season's got it starting soon. <laughs> And then everything's <gasps> new anyway. How much could the shop provide if she were to buy some? Let's get these tabs. So, I never of the medium ones. And we can't buy the big ones. Find the dust. These are also void because they're gonna be new guides for them with the new items. CC or damage dealt on your team. That doesn't seem worth the price. What are you looking at currently? Uh, I'm kind of trying to figure out if there would be any value in buying experience. Ah. It would be fine if I were to buy like the. Hundred adventurous experience because I got enough of the master of starters, but there's nothing in the stack litter exchange and like this. The sets in the gift shop are pretty useless for the price. Like you could buy. Uh, Buy like 50 heat switch, some like an enchantment orb, a fragile resin, and sell more for almost 1000 chances crystals. And that just seems like a waste of money. Hmm. Also, I would. I didn't expect that I might need to actually start farming chests just for experience materials. <laughs> I need both XP and money, so yeah, I need to really get better with that. Like I said, I just saw with like playing daily and like sometimes doing map and sometimes doing story, I can just, yeah, get a bit better at all this. 
Like, if I were to not get Layla, I would mostly be fine. I would just need another 50 hero squids and 3.5 million more to get Pyra from 1 to 80. So I basically said to get one additional character up, but like getting two up would be a problem. But the hero there may have been a little too many there. characters recently. Oh yeah, I know that feeling. For some reason, there's been a bunch of new character releases. With yeah, I have no idea why. Anyway, we wanted to suffer. Yeah. We I wanna would, suffer. I would actually try to get Amber in because she actually got decent fire shield trap. Sure? Sure, sure, sure. Even though she ain't that level, but it works well enough. I wish I had like a shielder that would also do damage to protect her, but... That won't quite happen. And I don't have anybody else who... I mean, I could technically up the pack like a Benny or a Toma. Would both uh, work, also. yeah. But neither of them deal damage, so mm. I'll and just need to be a bit careful. Just going for Amber and Amber 2.0. Yeah. I got some energy on Amber already. Like so, energy situation. The stomach is so bad. How? That one slime just randomly got its shield back. Uh, yeah, because we didn't kill it fast enough. On my screen, it just got the screen back while getting fired upon and never... Like, it was, wouldn't have taken that long to get there. I will have order. Gather. Don't waste my time. Amber with the Rookie numbers. Well, she's doing her best. This domain is still a pain. Because we don't have a dead uh, character that can support the f uh, conditions of this domain, like in the artifact domain. Well, in the weapon domain. What? This feels honestly like a Deluke domain. You know? Like you can already shatter the shields with your Kramer, and then you also have Pyro on it. You don't need stamina to use them. I feel like it would also be a domain for leveled amber. Leveled amber and clay. Come here, slimes come. This is order. Yes. No one escapes. Gather. Don't waste my time. Bah. It's first. Stronger 
strong feelings about this domain and they're not positive at all. Ow. Please don't kill poor Amber. First. She didn't do anything to anybody. She isn't leveled yet. Yeah, poor Emma, baby. Also, the storing effect of cryo is bothering. Yeah. This is just overall pain. I'm g like, I don't like a lot of the earlier domains. I'm glad they got better. <laughs> I feel like this is like the worst one, and the second worst would be the weapon domain if you would have ammo uh, I mean uh, Ganyu so Quire Ambo or Ayaka so Quire Ambo and even then they're annoying with like their their bubbles they can put on you and make you immobilized I personally feel like with those characters, we actually got some mm, way to counter the domain. Meanwhile, here we are kind of just stuck. Uh oh. So Emma was just starting to use a burst, but the game decided no no you took damage, you're down. Solidified. Please no pillar in my face. Order guide you. It's nothing. Your life is mine. Don't waste my time. Good. Well, Amber did her best, and it was enough. And well, so the man showed some mercy. Uh, three ones, a total of three golden materials. It's like wonder. Yeah, that's pretty good. Just like with mine today. So that would be it for me. Okay. Now, well, Amber just needs to get revived. At some point, I'll have her leveled. And then she'll show that domain who's boss. Maybe I'll also get some constellations by then. Mm. Weren't Emma's best constellations pretty early on? I mean, she likes <laughs> all of them. Yeah. Um, but I feel like I you already have her burst potential with the two, and especially with the four, and then the six is just um like overall party buff, which is. Still great, but I think most of our potential is C4. Uh, problem is, I still have at C0. Ouch. Mine's at uh, C1. My Lisa's doing great. My Lisa's at C4 already. Like I said, as soon as she's C6, I wanna level her up. My Lisa is at C2, and my Kaya is at C1. I think my Kaya is 2. Yeah, C2. I got his first run pretty uh, early on because um, having more crit rate against opponents affected by cryo, like 15% more is just godlike if you play him in a freeze team. So you're saying that on top of the cryo synergy, he has his personal cryo synergy? Yeah. So you get. Oh god, how much do you get from Blizzard Strayer? You get. 
Um, 40 from Blizzard's Dreyer. Uh, you get 15 from his constellation, that's 55. You get 5 per default, that's 60. And then Cryo Resonance is... Uh, Cryo Resonance is another 15. So that's 75% crit rate. Yeah. That's a pretty easy setup for 100%. Yeah, so because you only need 15. Possible. And then you can just put crit damage into him. Yeah, and if you use him as main DPS, maybe you would even have the potential of a quick weapon. Mm. His C1 is only for normal and charge attacks, not for his ult. So this as is only for, for main DPS. As I said, if you use him as a main DPS. Yeah. I don't recall what I ran him with. I think I actually ran him with Black Sword. Which is completely too much crit rate. I know that, but... I don't think I had a crit damage sword back then. Nope. Um, I didn't get the black one from the shop. And this one has the additional bonus of... Your normal charge attack dealing 20% more damage, which was also nice. I mean, you could have always played him with the flute. I think I did it at the like beginning, beginning. Let's see. May I steal some of Nahida's lotus from you? You can get everything out of snow. If I actually want to get my child up, I would need to deny you access to the beach in Vira. Well, I only need, I think, one more run to have my um, Yelan done so I can do it on my beach. Also, I don't have her yet, so yeah. If you need more uh, contracts, you can get it from me if you want to. Well, I'm not entirely set on getting the Petri Harbinger yet. Or if for some reason the other Harbinger might actually be my interest. Oh, you mean Scaramouche? Yeah. But then again, he's animal, so... I don't know if... Did he look at the leaks today? Mm, nope. I just know he goes into like some flying state, I think, with his E. Yep. Now, the thing I want to mention is they actually don't. They actually what? They would use his numbers again. Okay. So. I'm actually. Like, I'm not sure how much damage he was doing, but apparently it was too much for them. Time to act. For the role that he's supposed to be playing, which I would assume would be main DPS. Just based off of the kid's description. I didn't look at the actual damage numbers that people could push for. I see everything! But, well, I guess it would be better if he wasn't overtuned, so there isn't an absurd damage race amongst the uh, hero high stars. Oh, Queen is already a problem after all. Yeah, but that's the case with like every gacha game to some degree because if your characters don't get better in some way or more interesting or more gimmicky or something um people are just not gonna pull on them no i didn't want to take this one uh, i want to take the other teleport like the other star thingy now where's my 
Where are my flowers? Game, where are my flowers? Nahida, could you please not fall down? Where are they? Oh, she's small. She got no power in those little arms. She sh slipped down with her feetsies, so... She also has little power in her little feetsies. She is so adorable. So basically what she's saying is she's small. So basically, I'm very small. I just thought I saw sparkling somewhere, and then it was my my bird companion. Ah, I found him. There we go. No, my sword. I see everything. Okay. I still need to do the Aranara quest. I still need to do most of that one. Like I started it, I did something, I unlocked a little bit of content, but it was like... Actually, I don't need to push it further. So I didn't. But I might actually need to do it if I want to get more books. Or I might do some more character stories. Oh, I, I have so many character stories. I mean, the five star stories always give you a couple of use wits. I'm too far away. Let's try it from here. No, I'm still too far away. It's a comfy ability, but like not a far range because that would make it a little ridiculous. There we go. Okay, then there's. I just imagine her being able to scan everything within sight and just standing on top of a mountain and just scanning the entire map. Oh, would be so cool. Just imagine you go up on Dragon Spine, you just circle around like three times, and it's just like bam, every collectible in the game. Uh, next, we need um, a character that can get us. Like boss really easily. Um. Again, I don't expect us to have to find more ores in the next region. So. Okay, uh. where are my? At least oh. I don't think there would be any reasons for. Oh major reasons for more ore based characters in the land of the wet. Land of the wet. I'm really looking forward to the so called land of the wet. Oh, oh my. You know, now that we got all the dental reactions, dental slimes actually bloom when it's raining. Yeah? Didn't you know that? It's been like that uh, since 3 1. Uh, 3 0, uh, sorry. I rarely run around when it's raining, and I rarely run into, uh, or rarely run into any of the dental slimes. I can't see my, my stamina. And I just drowned! Thank you, game! You're very welcome. Thank you for literally nothing. Okay, I'm just gonna get other ones. Jesus. Yeah. 
I'm in a cave. seem that way, yeah. I don't get this teleporter. Uh, I would assume there will be more content if I would progress uh, that particular part of the map a little bit more, probably. Oh no, that that's not my part. issue. It's like they made like a, a pa um a farm route that says like, oh yeah, you can get from there to there really easily, but like you can't. Because it's inside a mountain? In maybe the underground passage would No, be not that direct way they drew in. Then maybe they just didn't think about it. Just yeah. looked at the map and were like, teleport us here, the tears are there, let's go. Yeah, it's, it seems like that. Okay, let's see. Should be around here. There's a big fat bird over here. I have never seen that one on my farm at all. Oh, so I don't see it either. Yeah, I legit can't see it. Okay, whatever. Then just let's take just. Oh, this one's also stupid because. Oh, because it's inside. Yeah, I'm just going to the others. Okay, let's see. Oh, that one is like at the very edge of the place, basically. Oh no, I'm just gonna, like, if I'm gonna do it at your place and at mine, I'm gonna have you wait more than enough for now so just, do you. just go down here Okay, there's these, and then there are more over here. Uh. Are there any more as to that? That seems to be it. Is my plan. So far, I should focus on so and yeah, Miko in the coming days, except on Mondays and Thursdays. I might actually change Nahido's focus from. Eight nine two two nine eight. Because I feel like her boss doesn't have offer as much value as the skill. Yeah, her skills do as a, like her burst doesn't do damage, so you just get like the bony up the more you level it. Like damage bonus, trigger interval or um duration extension. Yeah. So like for your your team with Nilu that would just be like duration extension, so that's like really not important. Um, so uh, all your damage, sense. yeah, and all your damage is like in, in E. Yeah, I will change the focus in that regard. Like it doesn't hurt to have the long duration, but, uh, yeah. I mean, 
the thing just lasts way longer than you and Barbara can apply Hydro for. Star is not going in the right direction. I wanna go this way. Glide, little Nahida, glide. Uh, in two days there'll be another spiral abyss rotation to follow. Yay. Let's see if they change anything up. If they'll stick to the current mob rotation. Well, I wouldn't know what they could add in there that would change anything. Different boss, question mark. Like the only boss they aren't using right now is the uh, Eon Blight Drake. Maybe at that one? I don't know. They might just not change it at all. You know what would be like the weirdest kind of thing they could do? What? Add one of the weekly bosses. And like one team has to do the first half of the HP bar and the, the second team has to do the second half. Oh no. Ouch. That's not what I want to do. Uh, would be fun. I don't think they're gonna do that, but it would be a fun idea. It would be Can problematic because the weekly bosses aren't meant to be done quickly. For the most part. Like the newer ones are just nope. set to last a while. No, my sword. Like you can rush a child, you can rush a storm tower, you can probably also rush the wolf. But like it's newer, so the phase that just takes a while because you are physically unable to do it any quicker. Almost burn. Remember. Yeah, but also the ice cocoon phase. Yeah, I know. Like that, before that it's quick, then the ice cocoon takes like a minute, it feels like. And yeah, the pyro phase, especially if you can't prevent her from going for almost burn is like yeah that's going to last at least another one half to two minutes i found a cave that's lowly sized so you can only walk in here when you have a lowly i don't think i can yeah i can't walk outside with, with Shingshu, only with naida Needs a mm, let's see, where's my last one? It's here. I need to go here on time. I think it would be fun <laughs> to fight weekly bosses in the abyss. They would probably also be terrifying to fight if they had more HP and damage. Oh yeah, they would. Like imagine child but actually beefy enough to take a few hits so he can pack out his really big attacks. I mean, strongly can probably tank it. But you can only and that's not an argument, yeah. Strongly can take can tank anything. That's that's not a point. Well, you can strongly actually tank like some of the mechanics that are meant to end a fight. 
Well, he can't do that, but like he can he can tank. Uh, okay, some kittens are just uh, jumping into the death. Um, Zhang Li can tank the whole Storm Terror attack, like her, his breath. I think here. that's kind of why they added some do the mechanic or die yeah. mechanics. <laughs> Even though it kind of bothers me a little bit. Yeah, I don't like one shot stuff either. It's just cheap because it's an either you dodge this or do the mechanic or you just die. It's it's not fun. My personal problem is it kind of limits the team diversity and if the one person dies during the fight then you're just like Oh hey, this is a mechanic. React with this element. You can't? Oh, too bad. Uh, where are my... Uh, where are you? They are a bit further along on the cliff. Oh uh, god, that like was so... There are some, and there are some a little bit further down the line. No, no you don't! Please don't. Thank you. Oh, come on. So we are spiral. Loli! Loli swim, it's so cute. I think I'm clear. Okay, let's see how many I have and how many more I need. I am at. Okay, I need 69. Nice. Uh, more for 80, 90. I already have her at 60, 70, so I have her fourth passive, so that's okay for now. And then the rest I think I'll just like farm slowly but surely. And then I, like I said, just need the clay ones and the Tenari ones. Okay, how do I hit? How do I still have so many electro drops? Electro what? Like uh, electro crystals. Oh, you mean these? I have no idea. Sometimes you just pick them up, I guess. I still have 101. That's not that many. Uh, those electro crystals. I meant the uh, electro gems because oh, I okay. recently up felt like I upgraded a couple of them and I forged some to be used for the Naida upgrades and I'm still supposedly ready to upgrade like six large gems oh three characters worth of large gems so 18 oh, let me see like some I still have a lot of cryo gems I even have like one big one gemstone and I have decently many um, Geo stuff. Yeah, I'm actually good for Geo stuff for Ningguang to from 70, 80 to 80, 90. And I haven't even farmed her boss yet, so. Okay. I would be starting to struggle once I add Razor, Beidou and Lisa as well, and Kaching. But at the same time, also need to farm a lot of bosses for all of those, so I would actually be fine, probably. Yeah, I need like one more large gem for Ayato, but I also need to do his hypostasis more. So I think I'm good on that regard. I need 33 more drops, so that's like at least 11 runs. 
So yeah, I think I'm good with Hydro Gems as well. I'm, I'm fine with Pyro. I need love Dendro. Oh. I'm currently struggling with Hydro because I upgraded my Nilu from 1 to 80 and also gave both Team 2 and Yelan the 80-90 treatment and had to up uh, also my Mona and well Barbara also finally had got to hit 70-80 mm. because for the first time in forever she got positioned who? Barbara Ah, oh, yeah, right, because you don't have a cook in me. Oh, by the way, um, conspiracy theory. So, you never really had a need to, like, put healers on your team, right? Even with corrosion from, like, doggos, it was still like, oh, yeah, you can get by with strong shields and passive healing, right? Because it can't kill you. Yeah? Most part, yeah. So did they deal with this issue by adding Dendro because the Dendro cores hurt you and you actually require to have a healer in these, basically? I mean, if you had a shielder, you wouldn't. Like, only Nidu is struggling with requiring a healer. Every other team constellation can just add whatever shielder and be done with it. Strongly, because he's just, like one of the only Dendro shreds. Yeah, but you can also use Diona or Toma or well, a high constellation Beidou. Wait, Beidou gave a shield a high constellation, didn't she? Yeah, but only like at the start of her burst, I think. But it's, it's not that long, long lasting, I think. Let me see again. It's been a while since I packed out Beto, which is sad. I like Beto. Beto's fun. If you ever want uh, to let's it. see. It's a 15 second shield. You mean her ult? Yeah. Use a burst and you get a 15 second shield. Which isn't terrible, and based on the first cooldown, it would have a 5 second cooldown. But it's only 16%, I don't think that's yeah, strong. It isn't, and you also would need to build your Beidou for more max HP. Yeah. So it could work if you somehow build a team around doing elect. Uh, reactions off of her electro application when she does matter for it. Ooh, her C6 is sexy, OMG. During her ult, the electro rest of surrounding uh, opponents is decreased by 15%. Yeah, I would like that, but my main electro damage team won't be able to use it because Mihoyo decided. Yeah. So you can't apply Beidou's burst to the Red Shogun. What Sino can? Well, you got a Sino, I don't. Yeah, but like, I mean, this, it's just ridiculous, you know? Yeah. Well, I mean, technically, the Red Shogun could still profit off of it. She won't get the damage of Beidou's burst, but she could still profit off the new used resistance. But then again, I don't think... What was it? 15%? 15. Resistance yeah. I don't think that's... Well, basically sacrificing the entire slot. Yeah. If she doesn't also do damage, yeah. Yeah. Like your other characters won't be doing too many attacks to make use of it. Okay. I'm farming a Tinari right now. Tinari slash if any other character needs this resource. 
we still don't know what our hyphen will need. And we'll probably only find out next patch when leaks might start to come out. I would strongly expect him to still need to then for cube. No, I mean like um, local speciality. He didn't seem to have any affinity for like any particular flower. If it's even a flower, it could also be the the um, mushroom from Kole. Well, flowers, mushrooms, you know, it's kind of different. I know I would. I saw, probably stepped on many feet there, but. Yeah, you just you know offended what? like every biologist in the area. Ooh, are you still buggy, little dude? No, he's not buggy anymore. I can actually attack him, I think. Yeah, I think that one time it was mainly because of the connection error. Let's see, he said, like, no, you really should be able to attack me, but I still get to attack you. Did that stuff just all fall down? No, it's okay. Yay. Uh, let's see. I'm here and I need to go up here. How many? Oh, so lovely, lovely conscious do I actually need to farm? All 140. It's not that bad. The um, farming routes are really easy, especially if you have a... Do you have a Chi Chi or a, a Yanfei? I do. Yeah, uh, let me see. Uh, I'll just run around so, you know... Wait, wait, wait. Like, yeah. Those are the farming routes. There you go. Sounds like some people actually took the time to... Actually, plan things out. That's like I don't know. I c would be able to follow. I mean, I would be able to just do that. It's not that that awful. But if someone else does it, uh, I am also not complaining. I feel like for that one part, I would like to have Mona with me. Well, I will probably just take my Ganyu team. Uh, for time being, Amber can leave the Yomiya team. I need to switch to single player mode again. So I can actually change teams. I see everything. Pass it on. Did she see me? Yeah, she does. And let me read. Uh, Diana with Chi Chi, both are small coin units, so nobody will see the difference. Rain outlines your. Okay, those should be all the flowers here. Yeah, then there's supposed to be more. Oh, there's one. There's a fish. I see everything. There's so. one. I am thinking how likely or unlikely would it be that I am going 
to get lucky uh, for my next five star. Well, it's probability, so I don't know. I know it's probability, but I tend to have decent luck. I would hope to have enough luck to maybe win the 50-50. Like maybe going to hard pity, but still going for 50-50. So, you know, it wouldn't be that bad. After all, I still want to be able to save for the year. Time to act. Uh, let's get my drops. One and a two. And a one and a two. Mm. You know, maybe Dia will be the one to finally best uh, of the monsters domain. True, could be. Could be. A part of me really still hates that all the Samaro characters are so great. Because I just can't get all of them. Yeah. I mean, at least they were kind enough to make Tanari uh, uh, stand up on a character after his initial run. Oh yeah, that's really nice of them. I really appreciate that. Because it means, yeah, at least have some chance of like getting him. Yeah. And also it saves them from having the same fate as like Kokomi and... You and Mia, well, he would probably always have a terrible, terrible we one window. Yeah. I still don't know who at my Yoyo has a problem with those two. Everyone help him. They're just too gosh damn adorable. Oh no, uh, I'm in too deep water. I'm a lolly. Help. Yay, meat. You know, I rarely use Mona, and it's just fun dashing through lines of enemies and randomly having your skill pop up. Oh, yeah. I see everything. In the abyss or anywhere else, you rarely dash long enough for metal or up here. There was a lot of nectar. Everyone help him. Let's go, Chi Chi. Spot all those conscious. One, two. Three, four, and a <sighs> And we found a call artist. Yeah, a few of them get mixed in between, but it's like very little, so hardly matters. Um, out of misery. I believe in Chi Chi being able to clear because the rest of the team can't. Chichi is great. Chichi can do it. Just believe in the power of the Chichi. I mean, if she can 
break my luck. She can certainly break rocks. Harsh. Like for Seven. both of you. Yeah, I lost pretty turtle too this time. It's sad. Bye. But I think that was only my second Chi Chi. No, it was my third. It was my second Chi Chi. It's my third. And to be honest, I'm not even really mad. Like. You know, sometimes you deserve or need to be brought down by some pity breaker. Because it would be bad to just always expect to get your 50 50. Or I mean, I wouldn't mind so. always getting my 50 50 except for like one Tainari or so. I mean, certainly nobody would mind, but. After being lucky for a while, it helps regulate my expectations. Where are my flowers? Where are they? Of course, that lightning randomly struck my location. Everyone's up here. Thank you, game. Get with me. Cool. Um. Go for sister crunch. I can also call up hers. I think I'm done with the good spots for Tainari. Let's see, how many do I have now? I have now a total of 126. You're almost done. That's 43 more than I had. Okay, yeah, so like one more run that gets exactly this much and then I'm done with Tinari. So like first day and then I'm done with him. Like with local specialty, that is. So should I get him? Uh, I have that uh, time bottleneck uh, already gone. So that's uh, nice. It's usually nice, but at the same time, if you don't have the turns prepared, you'll time gated anyway I mean yeah but like you know I just don't like if I have like nothing left to do but the local specialties but that might be because it was so bad for me when I got my IR car because I used a lot of fragile resin to farm for her because I just wanted her up and then I just couldn't get her up because there were so so few Sakura to farm for yeah, and nobody was yet ready to shell. Yeah, like Dredaich wasn't in Azuma at that point. He didn't even play at that yeah, point. Yeah, you weren't at I that wasn't point. Quite ready that, that yeah. Point, yeah, I could grab some of Lucas, but he only got to Samara a few days after me. And then Dodge got to him before me, I think. Uh, and Dodge also got Ayaka, so I, I couldn't get it from him. So, yeah, I I was just sitting there like, well, I got this many, and that's it. Like, let's see, how many Sakura are on the map? Let me, let me get the interactive one. Come on, open up. Okay, let's see, one local specialities. There's 75, but I don't think I... Knew where all of these were. I don't know if the map was on at that point in time. I don't remember. I probably needed a little bit to get all those running. Yeah, so or like... To spot all of them and mark them and 
confirm because there might always be some troll people. Yeah, so I think I got like 30 uh, rotation, which is like 60. And you need, how much do you need for one character? 168, yeah. So like, if that's 60 a week, that's like still three weeks. And of course I couldn't go to anyone else because everyone was pulling for Ayaka because Ayaka was the last uh, of the beta characters. So there were people that never pulled on any character just to get Ayaka C6. And they put all of their primos in there. Of course there was no one sharing their Sakura. Uh, Let's see, let's go for some more shells. So we're gonna start here. I'm happy that for the most part I'm I am at have partly been time gated like the most I've experienced in recent times has been what our dear Nahida has offered in regards of like the weekly boss stuff. Oh yeah, that was the next next thing that bothered me. What? No, I think she's she used. I think she used Asta stuff. No, never mind. Because Senior wasn't audit, okay, and I mind that didn't bottle like me, I think. Yeah, Senior was a little bit later. Yeah. I need to get to the island over there. Go, Mona, go. Go, go, Mona, go. Little mass of bubbles. And we're not talking about her button, there we go. Uh, one, oh, it was so cute. Um, we went on Lucas, um, we went to um, like a, a pub for Lucas' birthday. Okay. And we were just us four in the tram. So like me and him and Riak and Mike. And Mike's also a Genshin player. And then we were talking a bit about Genshin. And my boyfriend was like, Oh yeah, I just noticed this really weird trend. Like everyone seems to be like, uh, seems to think that, that Scaramouche has, has mommy issues for Bal. And I was like, yes. And he was like, oh yeah, why? And I was like, um, because she technically is his mom. Not genetically, but in any other way. And he was like, oh, I didn't know. And I was like, wasn't that already in the Inazuma story? And he was like, oh, yeah, I didn't get that. Oh, and then, like, he he thought, like, okay, yeah, that, that kind of makes sense, actually. I was just really confused. Also, apparently I mean, people skip Scaramouche with Mona. So that's also something. I mean, people skip Scaramouche with Mona because of... So, uh, the early stuff. Yeah, I think they were together in that event. Yeah, that's why Mona can also react differently to you if you participate in that event before doing her quest. Yeah. Which is like a neat little thing, but few people get to know that. Let's see, now I'm at 85 star conscious. That's a dish for 57, so two more times and I'm done. I'm 
kind of time gate by his tarp materials anyway, so I'm in no rush. And if I were to actually put him into the national team and bar into her own electrofocus team, then I would still also need to get like her two besties up. Ah, so her dumb and her sub. Yep. It's just a happy little sandwich. Just a ha happy little mm, romantic relationship. And then there's G. Hey. I'm also here. She's just. She's proud of all of them. This might die, you know. She's all dead. Alright. That is that. Is there another one? Yeah, there's another one. Another one bites the dust. And another one bites the dust. Conches are really easy to farm, that's a good thing. Yeah. Okay, let's stop this done. I will need to do some more fossils. Some domains, which I'm sure I will. I am at 179 conscious. That is enough conscious. So Yolan's done. <laughs> Means I only need to do Nahida again and Kalei. So let's see. Where's my Nahida one? Nahida's here. Let's just start from the bottom. Oh yeah, did these things finish downloading? Yes, they did. Cool, okay. Download two games to try. And now my Gami team can go back into the vault. Well, no. Here, yeah, yeah. Who has armor pull on the skill? Yes, he has 12 seconds uptime against 18 seconds downtime, so six seconds without hyper application. Mona has 12 seconds cooldown flat with her skill lasting, I don't know, not too long. Hey. Boop. But, bless you. I s didn't sneeze, I said boop. No. I got something. I, I. Uh, uh, I kind of just had like a little cut off sound, so I wasn't sure, quite sure. Well, I just booped something. Little Kusanali booped something with her skill. Don't underestimate the Kusanali. Thinking about it, I don't think that Nidu will ever do much more than be part of the team. Mm. It's kind of weird but interesting at the same time how they are creating some hyper specialized teams. Yeah. Or characters. Mm. 
like Shenhe can only really work with the Nutfire Cactus. Or oh, she only works properly with the Nutfire Cactus. Goro is only uh, Geo support. And Nidu is Doom only, and only if they are Hydro and Dendro only, and not like the occasional Cryo or whatever. Or, you know, uh. Um, like, uh, uh, a jungly or like some animals to swirl the hydro. You know, she likes some wet and she likes some bushy. All natural. The woman knows what she likes. Oh no, oh no, this reminds me of this really bad. Oh god. Um, okay, you probably. I don't know if this got around the internet much, or, or if this was just like a local thing, but this got around like in here a bit. Um, it was a ad advertisement for the Black Forest here in southern Germany, and it was of a really voluptuous woman in traditional um, Black Forest garb, um, and her eyes were really big. You know, voluptuous. And okay, what did he say? Let me, let me try to translate it in English. Um, high hills, thick forests, and wet valleys. And that was the official one. They made that. They wanted it to be like that. And apparently people were so appalled by it and offended that they had to take down their own advertisement. I mean... Would you want to advertise for your home with lots of tradition in like the most innuendo heavy way possible? I mean... Like, it's n not even like a subtext, it's like... It's just straight up, yeah. We could basically even put this woman then just nude and people would get the same impression. No, Naida, no. Just jump up. No, just jump up, not, not forward, just up. But I just want to jump on that mushroom. Just on the mushroom. Not too far. Nope, Naida. Naida, please. Please, baby. Please, bean. Small bean, small precious bean. Don't fall. Small bean versus wet cliffs. The cliffs win. No, the cliffs will never win. Baby will always win. Because she's the cutest. Um, okay, so what was that one? Those never got here. Alright, so I played my Yoromiya team so much that everybody in her team oh, is friendship rank ten by now. Aww. 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 Venti still needs two levels, Shenho still needs like half a level. Nahida needs like all the levels. Da. Doom needs like all the levels. Mona needs, needs like two levels. Is there any more? Tell me more, tell me more. Da 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 da. <laughs> like most of the characters in my regular teams are pretty far along the way. Some are almost always there, just from chilling with a tree pot. Mm. Razor stuck just before Premiership Rank 9. Poor boy. 
lesson, I'm trying to get him to the point where he can get his own Black Ops Red team. And we can race! Who's faster? Razor or Sino aggravate? <laughs> like I can put him and Lisa and Kaya and the Traveler in a team and they will be happy little team. Why Kaya? Because I would like to have like Kaya would be there to offer him some super conduct so he can deal more physical damage. Mm. But then wouldn't Zhongli already be better because uh, he also shreds Dendro Electro Resistance? Because, uh, I mean, and physical. He, he shreds everything. Yeah, I know that just puts Zhongli in every team, I know. Yeah, and I'm trying to set up most of my teams separately if I will not want them anytime soon. I mean... Also, more than Kaya, I should probably use Chi Chi in that team. Chi Chi can heal. Yeah. That team doesn't have a Chi Chi heal or shield otherwise. Chi Chi. Coco Goat. The legendary adapter beast. Chi Chi wants her coconut milk, please. Well, I mean, just just from uh, lore alone, Chi Chi should be uh, in our team with Coco Gold. I mean, you could put her there, but Chi Chi doesn't provide the necessary amount of energy that Gunny would like. Yeah, no. Well, for the most part, Ganyu doesn't need too much energy in addition to what she has, or at least in the way I built her. Like, if Venti does the thing, and I actually use her skill and stuff, then Ganyu is rather set on energy. But, yeah. Shields tend to be better for archers that need to actually focus on their firing. Who would have guessed? I see everything. No, I'm not close enough. God damn it. Well, you did it earlier, so get closer. Grr. Okay, that worked for this one. And that works here. Okay, so those were these ones. No, 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 go get these ones up here. Technically, child would be good for me to be able to use more teams. But that's about it. Also, he would be my first main, uh, idol main DPS. No, Nilo is. I mean, she isn't really doing much hydro damage. It's all about the blooms. There is a lot of stuff that refuses to just bend to my will. Well, you know what to say to those enemies. 
Vengeance will be time. yours. Only if I'm using Yurav. I mean, shouldn't shouldn't this be in you as a Yula main? Ingrained into your brain. I mean, I like offering vengeance. Something, something, vengeance, something, something. I mean, vengeance is also a great tool for RP characters. I see everything. Cool. Okay, so that's all the loaders for today. Um, I am at 82. Okay, I need 23 more. So I can do that on first day and then she's like just flowers. Um, just for the flowers she's ready for 80-90. That means I only need to defeat the boss more and get more XP books to level her up um, but I can do that as slowly as I want slash need to because I do believe that getting her uh, good artifacts is even more important so I will put her on hold for now uh, let's see I think I will put him on hold too because it's not that important to level up it won't do as much. I think I'll put Kulei on hold because I could also use Nahida in Ayato team and I might even do so. Put Shinobu on hold. She heals enough, does enough damage. Um, I will level up Iron Sting. I will level up Black Sword. I will put Rosaria on hold. So that only leaves for me to level Ningguang and Ayato when he comes and do the talents plus finish black sword and iron sting and after that i will start farming artifacts like the dendro one to get nahida up to speed to get a uh, cookie a nice em overload uh, not overload a uh, hyper bloom set and to get kulei a nice deep wood set and after i'm done with that I will finish the rest on my list and then I will go farm in the Hydro and Cryo domain because I can farm for both Kamisato siblings at once. Out of Death for Ayato and Blessed Stray for Ayaka. And everything that's bad out of the first run, like for the, the Dendro stuff, and out of the second runs for the um siblings i will probably put into thundering fury for sino and maybe some into archaic petra so i get two nice pieces for ningguang because she only needs two but sino needs five of them okay so. i see need lose first constellation would give her permanent uptime on her hydro application I mean, there has to be a reason why you need to pull for her C1, right? I mean, that is mainly the way to go if you don't want her to control the boss. How many pistols do I have? What a harder constellation. Five, three, nine, four, nine, one, two, and eight. Okay, I have enough crystals for my swords. That's good. Uh, and yeah, Niglu got some pretty juicy constellations. Well, then you have somewhere to go. I don't have the money for that.
Uh, don't I have that scanner somewhere? Hold up. Yeah, but I don't think it's updated. Like, the first thing is like her having bonus damage or additional hydro aura duration. The second one is reducing enemy hydro resistance and dental resistance. I'm at Then her C4 actually gives her additional energy and buffs her burst damage. So okay. at that point she'll be even more as an off-field character. Like, seems like Nilu as a... Well, with constellations wants to be more off-field and gives the control to somebody else. Ooh, kinky. And C6. For every 1000 points of max HP, you lose crit rate and crit damage will increase by 0.6% and 1.2% respectively. That goes up to a maximum of 30% crit rate and 6% crit damage. Nice. So also, I just downloaded the Chinese version of the scanner, not the English one. I'm not stupid at all. God, I'm gonna need so much more Mora for leveling artifacts. Same. Because if I get child and if I also get later, that will bleed me by some more. Which would mean that I might just end up destroying some additional four star artifacts for more. Or I start buying more out of the shop and more more from Tubby. Yeah, I already tried to do that every now and then. I wanted to stop buying more from Tubby because I'm starting to get low on Realm Quincy. I prefer to buy experience and the Twins and Resin. Let's see, I want to scan materials. Speaking of which... Oh, by the way, I checked yesterday and I can't place the teleport on the island where all the traveling okay. merchant was. Ah, no, no worries. That area is just out of place. Okay, now Kuchusawa is also at 20 point 10. Also, creepy circle she goes. Oh, uh, also, guys, um, I'm just running a scanner right now for my materials, but I don't think that it detected like my earlier. Taps? I'm so I might need to run it again. But uh, I'm just sick of could, always hand importing it. You could just interrupt it and go back to By what? There should be a um, okay. button. Okay, I just pressed escape, that worked. Uh, let's see. Then it should do the thing properly if you start out from oh, the mm. Final menu, I think. Okay, it should work like this. Okay, there we go. Uh, now 
to get really creative with what I'm forging in my teapot. And get the transient version and the box. Yeah, I don't have the required materials to keep on buying more there. Oh well, I don't want. Oh, Pokemon's dropping on first day. I'm really excited. Yeah, I personally stopped playing Pokemon for the most part. Like, tried to get back into it during Sun and Moon, but the games just didn't really get me super excited. And I hope those that end up playing it will have fun with it because you know, it's still a really fun game. It's just not for everybody at every time. Yeah, that's true. Well, I have everything for Black Sword beside Mora. That's cool. Well, I could already do that then again. Uh, let's see. Because kind of... Oh, how big is the Kutra clan's estate? Hmm? Why? Why are you asking? Uh, Kuchisawa just said that the realm isn't quite as big as the Kuchu clan's estate, so I was wondering how big the estate might be ah. if it's bigger than like an idol chain. Just, just really big, trust me, bro. Okay, I need to craft some things for it. Let's see. Game, give me a crafting table. Come on, load faster. Okay, what do I need to craft? I need to craft four big slimes. Got two extra. I need to craft 16 feline sprouts. Twelve, and I got three extra. Twelve and thirteen is fifteen, so I need one more. You're being generous today, Sucrose. And I need to craft four teeth. One X 
Monster here. Okay. Hold on. Chaos currently holding the sword. Hands. Send. And it's 8090. Wonderful. Means black sword. Yay. Okay. Ayato, Iron Sting, and Ningguang missing. So I'm gonna. Probably concentrate on getting Ayato up to speed for when I pull him. Why am I suddenly missing one Sakura Blossom? Like, not like it matters. It's literally one, but it annoys me. So let's just get one, I guess. Who could be a good subject for this? I guess I'll place my kitchen here. Since I don't have any plans on using her anytime soon. She may join the circle. The circle of life. Well, the circle of companions. I still need eight more hands. So I'll just see how many I get before Ayato drops in and I might just convert some. Ayato is most likely to release around like second half of the third pet. No. Yes, I still have like a full patch time. So you got like six, seven weeks. Yeah, I should get a few more hands. And even if not, I can just put the others into it and just change them up. Okay, uh, so I have... Wait, uh, I need to put that option on. Hold up. Let's value that in two. Okay, I need 15 days for Ayato. Um, mm. Counting Mora and XP books. But since I will get most of that with like events and quests with like the uh, XP books and stuff, it's not as bad. Most is his talent box and the drops from bus. At the current rate, I would need around 8 more days for child, about the 1 day for Kuchisawa, and 2 more days for Yaimi. That is if I end up pulling for child. Also, like, child's passive is really weird. You mean with like you get one level? You get one level of your basic attack and like everybody in his team including himself doesn't want basic attack levels. Is it only basic attack are you sure? Yes. Okay. I put him in the uh, thingy magic and it already automatically applies the plus one. And the 
it's plus one to basic attack. Which makes the uh, thing with the... Uh, uh, his E stance counts as basic attacks. Oh. Yes. I'm very sure it does. Pretty sure the child guide said you don't give a rat's ass about uh, basic attacks for the most part. You only really dive up one to fill the downtime with charge attacks. Yeah, but that's not what I said. I said they count as normal attacks, so they should get a buff from it. Like from the, the level of the first one, shouldn't they? No, Ray did something else. That's, that's effects. I'm stupid. Don't listen to me. It's alright, you don't need to know about character set. You have no reason to really pay attention to. I need to know about everyone. Then please tell me all the intricacies of Dory. Um, That's the difference, she's a capitalist pig dog. I thought you would just summarize her as well, she likes money. Yeah, you're right, it's somewhat wasted. It's only... Oh, sorry, only normal attacks. That's sad. Yeah. But that also makes the... the constellation addendum weird where you can... You get three additional levels to your boss. Or your skill. It may also be raised to level 15. By what... effect? Uh, yeah, by magic! Well, here's a witchy one here, so tell me, where do I find this magic? Uh, I can't tell you. You're, you're uh, not magic, so I'm not allowed to tell you, I'm sorry. So, but those are the rules! Uh, I'm, I'm... I see. Yes, 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 yes! I would never fool you, would I? Nah. You would never lie to me. Let's see where the ones I installed these two. Okay. I downloaded two games and I want to play them later. A bit. Well, I might just go to sleep. I'm really tired for some reason. It might be because I got up at 8. Yeah, that would do. I mean, the games won't run away. And you're more likely to have more time tomorrow. Yeah. Unless people were to occupy your free time with whatever. Mm. Unable to return to single player mode while inside the Serenity pod. Thanks, game. You're welcome. Guess I'll have to switch to a map of Tavart and just go there. Some interactions are weird. Yeah, they are. They are... But I think I'm gonna stop stream here for today because I'm really, really, really tired and I'm losing concentration. I don't think anyone has uh, gets anything nice out of me being this tired. So I will end it here for today. Uh, thanks so much for watching and uh, I wish you
wish you a good night, my little witchlings. Bye-bye.